What's up everybody? I just want to talk about small contracts and I want to go over the power of small contracts because I hear so many people turning down once a week, once a month jobs because they're scared that they're not going to be worth their time. Guys, I mean, if you've committed to creating a commercial cleaning business, there's absolutely no client that you should be turning down. Anything that's a reoccurring service should be taken in, in massive consideration because, you know, one month is not just, you know, something that you're going to be able to continuously grow from, you know. Most people have to get a client, a new client every single month. They need a new client. They have to always be searching for a new client. Whenever we get clients, they're going to be paying us every single month. So we hear a lot of people saying, we don't want anything that's once a month. We don't want anything that's once a week. You know, you got to really change your mindset on that because we're making so much money from doing those type of jobs for people in our community. You know, we have over a hundred small contracts like, like that that are paying us $200 net profit every single month. So, you know, when it comes to growing this business, you have to just stay focused on the big picture. hundred clients paying you $200 net, you're making $20,000 from just 100 small contracts in your area. If you do and actually look into all the small facilities, you would probably find out that there are more small facilities than there are massive facilities. So please change your mindset when it comes to the contracts you're looking to take on. You know, we have over 100 contracts that are paying us over $200 or at $200 net and we'll take anything at $200 and up. A lot of people we see are turning down once a week, two times a week even, uh, you know, cleaning services for people that are actually wanting just a smaller amount of cleans rather than going to go spend, you know, for Monday through Friday cleaning. A lot of people want to spend lower, especially when they're just getting started or when they're struggling with the economy being where it is. If you want to be recession proof, you want to actually hit the market every single time. Whether they're you know going through tough times or everybody's making money, there was times we were making more money from clients that are paying less. But the reoccurring model has enabled us to continuously build our, our portfolio because people are accepting our prices. We go into title companies that are you know 3,000 square feet, 5,000 square feet. We talk about you know what the prices that they are getting and some of the prices that they're getting uh, that they're scared of even taking on more prices from more people are you know the reason why they're not hiring out professionally. They, they think that we're going to be too expensive. So when we tell our title companies that are paying for once or twice a week cleaning, you know, we, we, sh we let them know we're not going to charge you $300 per clean. We're not going to charge you $200 per clean. We're going to give you an amazing deal. So most title companies that are, you know, or just smaller facilities that are like 5,000 square feet and below, we're charging about anywhere from 125 to 150 per clean, per visit. And this has enabled us to scale massively. You know, we'll pay, we'll charge 125, we'll pay our cleaner 75, you know, so let's just say 125 minus 75, we're making $50, you know, around $50. I would say you can add on 10% uh, for taxes and, you know, maybe uh, an extra 5% for uh, supplies because the supplies are very minimal when it comes to doing these smaller locations. You're, you're not going to have to need so many cleaning supplies uh, for a small location like this. So you say you're making 50 bucks every time they go times four times. You know, you're making $200, around $200 a month. You have, you know, 100 of these. You're already at 20,000. You know, whenever you're dealing with these smaller locations, there's so much potential because these people are never going to, you know, really worry about a $500 bill. Their facility is getting cleaned once a week. You know, they're going to be happy with that. It's not going to be hard for your crews. And the goal is to give your crew, you know, multiple lo locations like that in the area to where they can make 150 a day. You know, every day that they work for you, they're making 150 a day. Most of these locations that are 5,000 square, square feet and below take two hours or less to clean. They're going there wiping down, dusting, vacuuming, taking out trash, cleaning one or two restrooms, taking 30 minutes to an hour sometimes after they get a routine. You know, once you keep your people happy and, and, and actually build a routine, you're going to actually start being able to bring up your margins and make a lot of money. So, you know, don't do not take these smaller contracts for granted, guys. These are very good contracts that you can actually, uh, you know, capitalize on the more and more you start scaling the business. Once you lose one or two, really won't affect you. So don't take these for granted, guys. Let me know if you have any questions. There's a massive market when it comes to these smaller scale facilities. 
These are all on reoccurring and they're not going to budge when it comes to these small amounts, $500 a month. So this is something you can start building that reoccurring revenue and eventually turn into, you know, having thousands of transactions coming in every single month. You know, once you get to, to where you're working with these people and they refer you and it just starts building up like that, eventually you're going to have 300, 400, you know, small contracts that you're making $200 from. So let's get to work, guys. Let me know if you have any questions. Let's take over the entire market and let's grow our businesses for generations to come. I've had some small title companies and law firms and small insurance brokers for years already. And they're never going to leave us and go with anybody else because we give them such a great deal and they know we're always going to show up. So start building that portfolio of clients. Get a thousand clients.